It is currently 8.42. This is how I start. This is how I plan for the next day. So, I will always turn on all the alarms on my phone. And then I write out what needs to be done for tomorrow. I'm just showing you guys the basics, not everything that needs to be done for tomorrow. Because it changes every single day. So, like, tomorrow... What usually stays the same is work out, read, shower, get my coffee. But tomorrow I have an exam at 8.45 in the morning. I need to fix my Facebook ads account again. And then I need to purchase my plane ticket for Palm Beach, Florida. So this is how I usually start it off. And <clears throat> it is currently 8.43. And I will usually be up around at around 5 in the morning. So... I will see you guys at 5 in the morning. Okay, so I just got up. It is 5.02. I got up at 5.01. So let's start this day. Alright, it's currently 5.17. I just got up out of bed. And now it's time to start my workout. So I'm not going to show my entire workout because, I don't know, it's, it's kind of hard to like set this up and then go do the workout. So I'll come back. Once I'm done with my workout, and because I'm after this, I'm gonna hop on the computer, try to fix my Facebook ads, and then come back to this. Yeah. What's the weather out? Here's the forecast for today. All right, so this is my workout I'm with my brother. We're doing our run. Our total run is a mile and a half. So, you guys wanted the day in the life video. That's what you guys requested. So here it is. And it's only, what time is it? 6.50. 6.50. I've been up for an hour and 50 minutes. Been up for 20. Yep, but we're at this like park area. Nobody is here. Nobody. It's true dedication. That's what we're doing. It's, it's commitment. We said we're getting up and we're going for a run at 630. And that's what we did. I got up a little sooner than him, but by all means, it's dedication. We said we're going to do it and we accomplished it. Just got to keep moving forward through the rest of the day. Okay, so it is 7.12 right now. Uh, we just got done with the run. It was a good 1.6 miles. Um, yeah, but I have one of my exams at 8.45 in the morning today at my school. So 7.12, I've been like an hour and 30 minutes before I need to be there. And I'm going to go pick up coffee before I, before I get to school. And... Yeah, because this is one of my last days of school. I am graduating high school a little bit early, which is nice. Um, yeah, so I got to jump in the shower, change, get coffee, and then take my exam. So I'll be back when I get my coffee. Okay, guys, so it is currently 8.06 in the morning. I've been up for a good three hours, and I'm heading off to Starbucks to get some coffee, and then from there I'm going to head to McDonald's and get like a steak sandwich. And then I have to head to my exams, so this is going to be fun. And then after that, I, oh, I forgot to close my garage. Um, 
And then after that, I will be heading to this downtown area and getting some new photos. Uh, but I'll take you guys with me for this entire trip. So, yep, I will get you guys updated. Okay, so I got my coffee and I decided to try something new today. It's a uh, smoothie. Yeah, organic defense up. Orange, pineapple, mango, apple. So, that's pretty nice. So now I'm going to head to McDonald's and get my breakfast. My breakfast. And then from there, well, it's 8.17 now. It's 8.17 now. And then I'm going to head off to my school, take my exam. Then after that, I'll be done around 10 a.m. And then I have the rest of the day for myself, which is really nice. So I will give you guys updates throughout my day. It was like a steak sandwich. It was a breakfast sandwich. Steak bagel? Yeah, could I get that, please? Just the sandwich? Uh, can I do Apple Pay? Thank you. Okay, guys, so I just got it while well, I was at the stop sign. I got an email from my school, guest speaker, yes, you, um, hi Zach, in parentheses, aka soon to be high school graduate, um, since you've obviously mastered speaking in front of hundreds of students, what do you think about talking, what do you think about talking with 25? So the school wants me to do um, some guest speaking. Oh. Almost another accident. Um, that's actually kind of cool. So I would be talking with the entrepreneur class, the uh, marketing classes, personal finance classes, the intro to business classes, all at my school. And that's a great opportunity. Like, who would turn that down? Oh, come on, make the turn. Uh, that's actually really cool that I got that email. So... <clears throat> I'm gonna do it, so next semester, since I graduate tomorrow, I graduate tomorrow, uh, I'm graduating one semester early, I, I'm i gonna take it. I'm going to do that guest speaking. Why not? Like, that's actually really, that's, it's honestly exhilarating to think, and holy crap. Am I gonna find parking? Yeah, I will. Okay, sweet. I didn't get here too late, I got like five minutes before my exam, uh, but I am, that'd be awesome to actually do that, to take this guest speaking thing, because um, I've always wanted to be like a public speaker, I don't know, that's just, it's kind of exhilarating to like talk in front of people, oh, my buddy Lenny, it is 8.37, so I got a few minutes till my final, and I will see you guys after my final. All right, so I just finished my exam, and that was really easy. It was like an hour, it was just 90 minutes of, it was worth 20 points. It wasn't even like a real final. And it was a pain to get in my car. This guy parked so close. Like, look at this. I could not even open my door. Look how close that is. <laughs> All right, so it is currently 10.32. I talked with the, like uh, some teachers, because like I graduate in just one day, and oh my God, this guy parked so close. I graduate in just one day, so I, uh, what is it called? I just like talked with some teachers that like, I know I'm not gonna see you tomorrow, so it's just like 
a little goodbye. Yeah, but I'm gonna go pick up my brother, my older brother, and take him somewhere. And I'll, show, I'll take you guys with us. Okay, Zach, what are we doing? So we are heading to this downtown area. We're kind of stuck in traffic a little bit. Um, and we are going to go take photos. I got my big camera, my DSLR in the back seat in my backpack. And we're gonna get some photos for our Instagrams, for Josh's Instagram and for my Instagram. Make sure you guys give us a follow there. Most of you guys are probably coming from my Instagram, so make sure you give him a follow. So we will see you when we're there. We're probably gonna be there in another 10 minutes. It's 11.23 right now. But yeah, the day is still young. I've been up since five in the morning. Six hours strong. My day in the life is gonna change really quickly because in one day I graduate high school. And then next month, where are we going, Josh, next month? Fucking LA. We're going to LA. Oh, here's a cool photo spot. So we're gonna be in LA for a while. Um, we're getting, I'm not gonna tell you what, we, what we're getting while we're out there, because, you know, I don't want anything in case plans fall through. That's what we do. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's, I'll keep you updated, guys. Okay, guys, so we just finished up at this little spot that we were shooting at, and now we are going to go and try to find another spot. So, uh, I'm not quite sure where we are going to go, but you can see. Josh is just chilling right there. That's actually a pretty cool shot. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know, this is kind of cool. <laughs> All right, let's go find another spot to record at or shoot videos at. I'm heading off to a meeting right now. It is 3.12. So I haven't picked up the camera in a while. I was trying to fix my Facebook ads, but I'm still trying to fix it. I was on the call with Facebook, so it's taking some time, but I just gotta push through that. But I'm going to a few meetings right now. I probably won't be done until 5.30, 6.00. Six, six thirty, around that. Um, usually the meetings last pretty long, and the person in front of me is going very slow. I have to be there at three thirty. I always like to ar arrive a little bit early, so I can uh, just get my mind in the right mindset. I don't know. I'm always an early person. I wake up early. I go to bed early. I try to get things done before everyone else does because that's the only way we can succeed in life. So, yeah, I will keep you guys updated. Oh, wow. So I will keep you guys updated and I will let you know what's going on from there. So I will catch you guys in probably three hours three or four hours okay so it is currently what time is it it's 6 5 p.m. and I am just now leaving the meeting so I probably got I got like a good 20 25 minutes until I'm at my house so this is gonna be fun and it's rush hour right now so that's that's no fun. There's one thing I'm gonna talk about, and sorry I'm not pointing the camera at my face, because I don't, I really don't want uh, the light on in my car. So I'll just show you guys the road. Um, so, right now I am super tired, because what I do is when I wake up late, I mean not wake up late, when I go to bed a little later, I always try to wake up at the exact same time every single day so that's 5 a.m. sharp and this morning I think I woke up at like 502 so but 
I went to bed around like midnight. So I'm running on like five hours of sleep right now. So I'm probably gonna go to bed really early because I am n completely out of it right now. Like during the meeting, I'm I'm, I'm kind of falling asleep. I'm nodding off. So, which is not good at all. Um, oh, oh, wow, lots and lots of traffic. Did not expect this. Um, but yeah, so I will probably, probably be going to bed around eight o'clock tonight, which I know that's pretty early. I might even go to bed at like seven, but I also have to complete some things. Even though I'm so tired, I gotta, whatever's on my checklist for today, I have to do. And that's, that's what, that's why I fell asleep so late last night. That's cause I had way too much on it. And that was like, I, I anticipated it. I thought that it wouldn't last as long, so that, Wow, look at all of this traffic. This is Chicago for you. Literally, Chicago traffic is the worst. I haven't gone that far, and it's 8.02. That's really sad. Not even gonna lie. So, I will... I'll catch you guys later. I gotta drive, and pay attention, and try to stay awake. Adios. Alright guys, so I'm wrapping up the night. I'm wrapping up this video here, 7.36 p.m. Um, <clears throat> I gotta wake up early tomorrow because once again I have another exam. I'm taking my AP exam tomorrow so that's going to be fun. And I gotta, I'll be up at 5 in the morning again to go for a 6 o'clock run again. Just rinse and repeat. So, I'm signing off here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you guys like want me to do more like this, hit that thumbs up button, and I'll be sure to do this like when I'm traveling, because it's always different for me. There's no like my day isn't the same every single day. It is completely different. Like, but there is one thing that is like almost the same, is that I get that flat tire light on my car. Or the tire pressure light on my car which that happened today so that's why like you're not gonna see like a second part because I didn't record it and we didn't make it there because I got the um, flat tire so I had to deal with that today um, but if you guys want me to review your like Shopify stores or anything just send me a DM on Instagram uh, here's my Instagram it's gonna be there it's also going to be in the link in the description. Uh, go follow my brother. His Instagram is going to be in the description as well. So, all right. Without, make sure you guys like, hit that subscribe button, and I'll keep posting more videos on here and help you guys out with your journey through Shopify, drop shipping, and becoming a, a successful internet entrepreneur. All right. I'm going to leave you guys there. Peace.